So this is the new Cadbury's milk tray. Um, I have to admit, I already had a sneaky chocolate because I couldn't resist. So I'm opening the box that's already been opened and the tray that's already been opened. And you can see the missing chocolate up at the top there. But I believe there was two layers. So one layer has already been eaten. So you get two layers in a milk tray chocolate box and they look revamped and the flavors are revamped and here are the flavors caramel softy milk chocolate matched with its caramel sweetheart and let me find it now so there it is heart shaped chocolate very cute simple design and oops i have chocolate on my mouth already but that's what it looks like when you bite into it very caramelly soft melting caramel inside and it tastes really good i mean i have to admit i never really liked milk tray chocolates before but now the new flavors are actually very delicious and that caramel is just melting in my mouth it is just so soft and now we go on to the hazelnut swirl so hazelnut swirls are very famous in the milk trays and normally they're like you know standard hazelnut inside with caramel on the outside this one looks like a typical caramel, I mean, hazelnut swell. Oh my God, listen, replay, replay. Yeah, there it is, the crunch. So there you can see the hazelnut inside. And yeah, it's pretty much uh, dry, but the chocolate is very moist and it melts in your mouth. So it's very tasty. White chocolate truffle. So this one is in a parcel shape and with a little bow decoration and great for presents, I guess. And oh my God, yes, the white truffle inside. Oh my God, boy, was that nice. That was melting your mouth again. And because the outer casing chocolate is not too thick, it's just perfect. It's really tasty. And raspberries and cream. I always hated the fruit flavoured chocolates, but because they have revamped the flavours, I mean, the design on that one isn't great, but I guess it's two different shapes for two different fillings. But, oh my God, the, it was actually crunchy inside. The fruit was crunchy and the white chocolate was just divine. It was such a nice chocolate. I mean hands down to the to the raspberry and cream because it was really great so now we go on to the orange so because this was a truffle it is obviously very soft and yeah just almost like an arrow inside it's very soft and smooth and silky wow they've really upgraded their chocolates and i love them so now we go on to the salted caramel, one of my favorite flavors. And it is a s basically salt enrobed in smooth chocolate. So yummy. Oh yeah. Get that open. Oh, see? Oh yeah. Really, really nice again. It's not runny caramel, but it's just really tasty chocolate. I really enjoyed that one. Heart truffle. Another truffle. So it's going to be smooth. And another heart shape. So good for Valentine's. Heart shape with a cross for a kiss. Oh yeah. Smooth as hell. Oh my god. Like how nice is that? Honey crunch. Oh this was really really nice. I really like this one is above one of my favorites and i love the even like the new design for the honeycomb and um, honeycomb pattern with the bees and yes it was crunchy inside literally crunchy bits of honeycomb oh my god like and the chocolate was smooth everything just melted in your mouth it was just delicious great new design for that one Rewind Crunch Alert. The taster who approved these chocolates had the right idea. 
So the fudge jue. I'm not too keen on fudge because like it's nothing special for me. But yes, this one, I think that's like typical of a uh, Cadbury's chocolate box design. But yeah, this one was actually smooth again. Like just smell in your mouth, really nice. Not like a tough fudge. Really, really tasty chocolate again. Can't fault it. Well done, Cadbury's. And the perfect Paraline. Oh, yeah. It's got a hazelnut picture in the middle. So I'm not sure if it's got any hazelnuts in it. We shall find out. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Bits of hazelnuts. You can see the tiny, tiny bits. Hazelnuts and pink stuff. So this one was a bit of a secret because they just said gem. Encased in a gem. Whoa. 